Okay, go ahead, Gray. Oh, this is what I taught him today. <gasps> Woo! First time going down the slide backwards. And I had to show him by doing it myself. But go ahead, go in the house. But my butt is way too wide for this tiny slide. And so I was like barely going down that thing. Usually I do porter, but he's napping right now. So anyway, good morning, you guys. Grayson got a haircut this morning. Grace, show him your hair. Mm -hmm. <gasps> did you get a haircut? <laughs> what did you get? Up, up. Up, up, up. Up the house. Up the house. I was so nervous yeah. about this morning. I've been having my dad do Grayson's haircuts like ever since the pandemic started for basically like a year now. But I wanted to give my dad a break because Gray can be a little much. Like when my dad does it, like my mom has to feed him ice cream while they have a show on while he's doing it. So I just felt bad. So I just took him to like a like kids haircut place. And I was worried how he was going to do, but he did awesome. We just put on Coco Melon on Netflix on for him. He watched that. He never likes the little clippers where they get like your sideburns and like the back of your neck. But other than that, he did really, really good. I held his hands down. Are you sitting on the picnic table? I sit on the picnic table. Yeah, you are sitting on the picnic table, huh? Are you having so much fun? What did you get for being good at your haircut? What did you get from the haircut place? <laughs> what did you get? Did you get a lollipop? A lollipop. And a palm tree. A palm tree? Oh wow. So anyway, yeah, he did so good for his appointment. <laughs> Um, there was another little boy in there, younger than Grayson, and he was screaming the whole time, did not want his hair cut. So Gray did so good. I was so nervous about it. Um, did it really fast. And then they gave him a lollipop, a sucker as a reward. And then he also got a little token. So we went and put in their token machine and then like a little egg came out. And then there was like this little palm tree, like sticky thing that he got as a prize. Who's very excited about that. I enjoyed that. He did great. The only problem with that kid's place is it's so expensive. It's like $17 just for a haircut, for like a 10 minute haircut. I don't think it's worth it, but I don't want to take him to a regular place because I just worry that he'll like freak. So I might just end up going back to my dad for a while. I need like to learn how to cut hair myself or like Anthony needs to learn because that would be way cheaper than spending like 20 bucks every time we take him to go get his hair cut which is like every two months so it racks up but we're just hanging out Porter's napping I actually put Porter down for a later morning nap because um, we have his six month doctor's appointment today so we're gonna go and take him to the pediatrician he's gonna get more shots Yada yada. <laughs> Lots of things going on. Got Gray's haircut, got Porter, um, doctor's appointment. Anthony is home for the day. He's got the day off, which is super nice because he's been working like crazy. Um, it's supposed to be beautiful today, like 66 and sunny. It's sunny right now. Um, so it's gonna be, it's gonna feel so good. I told Anthony we should try to go on a walk. And then I also wanna try and build that trike that my sister and I tried to build and couldn't even get past the first step. I feel much more confident with Anthony helping me. <laughs> Sorry, Allison. So hopefully we can get that built and Gray can like try to ride it around because I think he would really enjoy it. Jack and Jill. Jack and Jill ran up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Jack fell down and broke his crown and Jill came tumbling after. <laughs> this is what we do every day. Are you so handsome? Did you, can you believe it? We're in the same room <laughs> every time. Yes, every time is reserved for Porter, huh? Look, I see how big you are. Oh! <laughs> Baby. Well, don't go backwards. <laughs> Are you looking so big? Yeah. <laughs> Do you like looking at yourself? 
<laughs> so fun. and he like took a whole chunk off of it. <gasps> what are you doing? What do you think of that? <laughs> oh, and he spit it out. I thought he'd just like munch on it, not like bite off a whole piece. Is that good? <laughs> <laughs> okay, don't like choke yourself. <laughs> so we're back from the doctor. I'm pushing Porter in circles while Grayson and Anthony are playing on the playground. Porter was taking a snooze and he just woke up, so that's why I was walking. <laughs> Otherwise, usually I take Porter out to just chill, but he seems okay in the stroller, so I think I'll just keep him in there. The doctor appointment went great. Porter's healthy, no concerns. They were shocked at how tall he was measuring. His height, I don't remember exactly what it was. I'll have to like look up the date or like his summary sheet or whatever, but um, they were, I think I heard 83rd percentile for height. Like he's tall for his age. And um, I don't know where he's getting that from because Anthony and I are both short. <laughs> I'm like 5'5 five five and Anthony's 5'8. So we're super short. So I don't know where he's getting these tall jeans from. Maybe my dad and my brothers because they're pretty tall. But my sister Kelly's pretty tall too. <laughs> But anyway, yeah, he's super tall. But other than that, everything's going well. He's checked out and we made our nine month appointment. So that'll be in June, but we're just trying to enjoy this super nice day out. Um, it's cloudy, but it's like 65. I don't know why I'm wearing a coat right now. because It feels awesome. But yeah, we're just kind of trying to wear the boys energy out um before bedtime porter took a nap like i said in the stroller because he had only taken one nap and i tried to put him down for another nap after his doctor's appointment he just did not want to he fights me sometimes on naps so i'm glad he got a little snooze in the stroller but yeah i think that's kind of it it was just a busy day with haircut and uh, doctor's appointment so I've been feeling very productive today so I hope you guys are having a productive Wednesday yourselves. <laughs>